What's going on YouTube? We're back with a quick fix. This is uh, going to be like one in a series of probably a couple or something. I don't know. This is just a real quick fix. Uh, I'm going to put this as I suppose like episode 1.5 even though we're at like episode 12 right now um because this should have been included in episode one but i thought i included it maybe i didn't <sighs> excuse me and that's my bad but a lot of people are having uh, a couple issues they're having issues where their players in a t-pose or i my guy's not holding his gun or he's in third person or it's not the the guy's not working right so if you're having any problems with your character's animations being weird like he's in a t-pose or he's in third person and he's like running around it doesn't look like what you set up that's probably and his and and, and sorry and and you still have the player left in the world, the the one that came with, that's a couple of your problems. So first of all, you're going to need to delete the player that's in the world if you haven't done that yet, because I've helped some people through Skype, and they still had the player there, and that was a big part of the problem. Um, so that needs to be done. If you have that third-person character still here, uh, he, should be, he should be somewhere uh, right around here. Uh, like I'm demonstrating with my cursor. I don't know how well you can see it, but yeah, he should he should be somewhere around here where I'm flying around. Anyways, uh, delete him, and you shouldn't have any characters in your area like I have. Um, you should only have like the ammo box and a weapon or two if that's what you're doing. Whatever. Uh, then the next thing that you need to do is uh, in in your blueprints folder, uh, right click, go to blueprint class, and click game mode. Uh, and so I called mine our GM, uh, or my GM. I, like I said, I thought I covered this, but maybe not. Uh, either way, you're going to want to open it up and, uh, once again, do only one thing in here, uh, on your default pawn class. Um, for some people, it won't look like this. And don't worry. Um, so, uh... It's going to look close enough. Just hold on. <laughs> so if it does look like this for you, uh, default pawn class needs to be bro dude or whatever the character you made is called. Um, but if it looks like this for you, um, which, you know, it might, you need to go over here and it's the same thing. Default pawn class needs to be bro dude. <sighs> But you're never really going to mess with this again. Sorry for the yawning. Um, you're never really going to mess with the game mode too much ever again. And last but not least, go to your settings. Go to world settings. And you'll see that thing popped over over here. So just drag the side over. Go to world settings. And in game mode override, select the game mode that you just created. Make sure everything's good. And then when you do play things should be Gucci if you set your player upright and whatnot. Um, sometimes you just have to go through the tutorials a couple times or whatever um, or or maybe double check all your connections or something that because you didn't do something right I don't I don't know um, so it changes it changes for each person but um, the each instance is a little bit different being that each person is doing it probably not hundred percent the way I did in the tutorials, um, just because they're trying to make it for their own game, and so they're not following everything, they're just following bits and pieces, that can throw you off. I'm not saying, oh, you're, you're wrong for that, I'm just saying, um, if this doesn't work for you, then it may be a different issue, and you can comment that, and I will be more than happy to uh, uh, get with you on Skype or something, and we can solve the issue uh, to the best of my ability. Anyways, I hope this does work for the majority of you. Uh, for the most people that I, I've seen have this problem, this was the solution. And like I said, if this is not, please add me on Skype. But, real quick shout out thing, donator, uh, Christopher Rose, I believe. Christian, Christopher Rose. Um, yeah, I think it's Christopher. Christopher Rose uh, was a donator on PayPal, so he has donated. Um, I, I'm obviously not shouting out how much, but I'm not saying, I'm not saying he donated a lot, but I'm just, anyways, amounts don't matter. 
you know, every little bit counts, and I thank you for that. Thank you very much, and once again, donate to my PayPal if you guys have not uh, already, if that's just like something like a small donation you want to do. Um, if you don't want to like just do a small donation and you want to keep up like a monthly donation, you can donate like a dollar every month or a little bit more every month over on my Patreon, and you get the same kind of benefits. You get shout outs at the end of videos if you donated. Um, it, it, that is if I've seen it. If I haven't seen it, I'm sorry, but I try and keep up with everything. And hopefully in the future, you'll get uh, cool little stuff uh, and things. So yeah, thanks for watching this video. Hope it helps. If it doesn't, throw, throw it in the comments and I will help you. Anyways, stick around for other FPS Destroyer series videos, hopefully RPG series. I'm so sorry for those of you who are following that. I have failed you, and for please forgive me. Anyways, I will see you in the next one.